Hey guys, my name is Chaotic, and in today's Grand Theft Auto 5 video, I'm going to be showing you how to get the trash outfit in GTA 5 Online. As I'm sure you guys know, there is no physical way of purchasing the trash outfit in Free Roam, but by using a glitch, I will show you guys how to do so. You can also use this glitch to get the police uniform in Free Roam as well. If you guys want to see a tutorial for that, click the link in the description. But anyway, this glitch is very easy, and it also works on all consoles as well. So yes, it works on the Xbox One, the Xbox 360, the PlayStation 3, and the PlayStation 4. Well, with that being said, and without any further ado, let's get straight into this video. So to begin with, what you want to do for this is get yourself into a lobby for the Trash Truck Mission from the Series A Funding Heist. Now if you don't have a friend that can invite you to this one, just simply go into a public session and wait for a random person to invite you to this mission. It's actually surprising how many heist mission invites you will receive. But anyway, once you're inside the mission menu, you can choose which outfit which you use. There are two choices, and these are the Collector, which has a t-shirt, and the Trash, which has a hoodie. But anyway, once you've chosen your outfit and the mission starts up, you want to give it about 5-10 to 10 seconds or so for the mission to fully begin, and once you receive the objective of going down to the South Los Angeles, Santos Recycling Plant, you can then press start, go across to online and then scroll down and select find the new session so that you're taken back into free roam. Now when you spawn in, you still won't have the outfit, there is still a few more steps involved, but when you do spawn in, go onto your phone, go across to quick job and scroll down and select play capture mission. And once it loads up and you're inside the mission menu, just go ahead and ready up. Now from here then, when you spawn into the capture mission, if you spawn in and you're wearing the trash truck outfit, the glitch has of course worked for you, but if you do spawn in and you're not wearing the outfit, you're wearing your normal outfit, then unfortunately this glitch hasn't worked for you and you'll have to start all over again from the beginning. But if the glitch has worked for you, once the mission begins, you want to open up the interactive menu, then go to inventory and then go to accessories, and you want to fit a pair of glasses to your character to save your progress. From here then just back out of the mission or just go ahead and finish it and once you of course go back into free roam your character will now be wearing the trash truck outfit. So there we go that is how that glitch is done. As mentioned previously it is a very easy glitch but do not worry if it doesn't work for you the first time. This can be quite a temperamental glitch. Just keep on trying and eventually this glitch will work for you and you can of course also save this outfit as well by going into a clothes store, going up to a counter and pressing right on the d-pad and then saving your outfit as a preset outfit. By doing this you can return to your outfit at any point if you change any of your clothes. Well with that being said, I do hope you guys have enjoyed this video and I hope this video will help you guys out. As mentioned previously, you can also do this with the police uniform as well and if you guys want a tutorial for that, there is a link in the description. But if you guys could take a few seconds out of your day to click the like button, it would help me out a lot and it's also greatly appreciated. Also be sure to leave a comment on this video to let me know your thoughts about this outfit and if you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel already, I'd recommend that you do because I upload all the latest and the greatest Grand Theft Auto 5 content. So once again, thank you guys for watching and I We'll see you guys next time.